tentacles are out when two subaquatic superstars wrestle for victory. Will the octopus camouflage and poison its way to the top? Or will the squid's sharp sight secure the win? This might be more mollusk mayhem than you can handle. It's squid versus octopus. Our salty showdown takes place deep beneath the surface of the Pacific Ocean. Though the scene seems tranquil now, things are about to get wavy. It's time to meet tonight's contenders. Let's hear some applause for our cephalopods. You don't want a hug from this nautical nemesis. With nine brains, three heart, eight arms, the octopus is a real-life sea monster. These clever creatures have the largest brain-to-body ratio of any invertebrate, and they tend to be independent unless they're mating. Roaming the sandy ocean floor, the octopus can squeeze all 25 kilograms of its body mass into nearly any crevice. They can also camouflage themselves by changing their color and pattern using skin cells called chromatophores. An octopus moves via jet propulsion. It sucks in water, contracts its muscles, and forces the water out. This propels it forward. With a body composed of 90% muscle and an arm span of four meters, Octopuses grab and suction their prey, piercing their shell with its hard, sharp feet. To seal the deal, the octopus injects a paralyzing venom called tetrodotoxin. The most deadly octopus species is the golf ball-sized blue ringed octopus, who is capable of killing 20 humans with its poison. Ugh, remind me not to get on his bad side. Next up is the master of deep sea deception, the squid. This creepy creature has lurked in the ocean's deep water for 500 million years, reaching lengths of 13 meters long and weighing nearly a ton. Only sperm whales dare to hunt these spooky swimmers. To feed on shrimp and small fish, the squid uses its eight arms and pair of lengthy tentacles. Measuring 2.1 meters long, these tentacles are lined with rows of suction cups and sharp teeth to capture and immobilize its prey. Fighting in the dark isn't an issue for this hunter. Squids are bioluminescent, so they're able to produce light to lure in their dinner. They also have excellent vision thanks to their enormous eyes, which measure 30 centimeters in diameter. And as if the water wasn't dark enough, a squid can shoot ink from glands in its body to confuse prey and distract attackers. Which oceanic opponent do you think will outsmart and out-ink its way to the crown? Well, drop your anchor and stick around. This is going to be interesting. And they're off. The octopus is tucked away in the sand and keeping one eye open for potential predators. After all, it's used to being picked on by its neighbors like moray eels and even fish. The squid glides over, hidden from the octopus. It scans its murky surroundings, easily detecting movement in the low light. The squid notices the sand shifting as the octopus readjusts its position. The squid is curious and drifts over for a closer look. It doesn't bother to disguise itself as it believes it can overpower the mystery creature. But the octopus also has sharp senses and fast reactions. It doesn't really want to fight, but this is a life or death situation. It turns to face its approaching enemy. The octopus releases a burst of black ink, buying time to conceal itself in the sand. Well, two can play at that game. The squid expels its own dark cloud of ink. 
the squid spies the repositioned octopus through the ink and harpoons its strongest tentacle from a shocking 10 meters away. The octopus recoils. One of its tentacles is now out of commission. Come on! Luckily, this fighter still has eight brains and seven arms remaining. And the lost limb could grow back in 100 days. But right now, if it can successfully inject its opponent with its deadly venom, the octopus could take the win. But the squid fakes out its foe by rapidly changing direction and gliding ahead at a steady 24 kilometers per hour. Now at close range, the squid goes in for the finish, using its beak to tear at the octopus's soft flesh. The octopus puts up a valiant fight, releasing more ink and struggling against its attacker. But it's not enough. The cloud of ink clears and reveals the champion. The winner is the squid. Had the octopus managed to pierce and poison its rival, the resulting paralysis would have been enough to turn the tables. Unfortunately, the squid didn't give its foe a chance. The squid swiftly stabbed the octopus, grabbed it head on, and tore its flesh apart. Now, the squid is the champion tonight, but how would it handle facing its only predator, the sperm whale? Well, we'll see who wins on another round of Versus.